video blog. I'm Jane Darling at Spiral Pictures. Today our topic is show up. You'll see why after I tell you about my day on the set of Terror Tales, a horror feature film anthology currently in production by Jimmy Lee Combs. I showed up to help out as production crew and it was nothing less than a filmmaker's amusement park. I have behind the scenes footage, including an exclusive interview with horror film actor Jan Birch, widely known as the Stairmaster in Wes Craven's People Under the Stairs. Today, he plays the role of Satan, but then talks about his career and then his friendship with Wes Craven, his new movie Sky Sharks, and the new sci fi he'll be filming this summer in Iceland. I'll let him tell you. Woody Allen is credited for the quote, 80% of life is showing up and 80% of success is showing up. And I couldn't agree more. And I'd like to add 99% of fun. I'm Jimmy Lee Combs. I'm the director of Terror Tells in your honor set right now. We've got a bunch of religious decor and uh, getting our possession on. Hello, I'm Dennis Vinson. I'm the writer, producer, and director of Rachel the Mummy. Hello, I'm Kevin Ward. I am an effects artist from Denver, Colorado, and a independence filmmaker. Currently, I am working on the upcoming web series, Bored as Hell, and I am the art lead on the upcoming feature by Jimmy Lee Collins called Terror Tales. I showed up at the studio of Irene Leonard. She is a local film actress, and she's currently in the cast of Terror Tales. In her studio, she had three fairly elaborate sets. One was a complete video store, around the corner a bedroom where Satan shows up to possess religious folks, and my favorite, the padded room of an insane asylum. All used in the Terror Tales anthology. Four filmmakers, house full of actors, special effects artists, and Jan Birch. I'm Tom Fierce. It's not right here. It was time to get Jan out of the Satan suit. He had to be roasting in it, but he was a good sport. This elaborate costume was created by Kevin Ward, one of the artists on the Sci-Fi Channel's Face Off and head first special effects first artist first. for the 13th floor in Denver and director of the web horror comedy series, Bored as Hell. He is being assisted like by Dennis Vincent, of director of Rage of the Mummy. Welcome back. Hi, I'm, I'm Jan Birch. I'm actually playing Satan in Jimmy Lee Combs' Terror Tales here in Colorado. Been here for a few days now, having a lot of fun. I, uh, in my past, I'm most known for playing the, the Stairmaster and People Under the Stairs with Wes Craven. Wes and I became quite close uh, friends and uh, all the way up to his death, actually, we were talking about, he was just starting to develop a TV series to People Under the Stairs that I was gonna participate in, unfortunately, but really good guy. So uh, I also did uh, Death House last year. It's coming out this year now. Sony picked it up. Uh, oh, actually, no, Sky Shark Sony picked up. Sorry, I got confused. Death House is being released in 3,500 theaters. Then I also did Sky Sharks. Uh, that's being picked up by Sony. It's a German movie uh, with all kinds of people like Naomi Grossman and Tony Todd and Jayla Rose and, and, and uh, Amanda Burris. Uh, lot, lots of people. Same with Death House. They have Kane Hodder. And, and, and Bill Mosley and Sid Haig and everybody's in it, Phyllis Rose. Actually, I was uh, 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 grateful to be able to involve Phyllis Rose in Terror Tales as well as The Witch. Uh, she's a fantastic actress and I'm really glad she could do it. And, um, you know, otherwise this spring, besides uh, uh, finishing off this Terror Tales with Jimmy, I'm shooting a movie called uh, uh, Don't Let Them In in Idaho in March based on a book. It's actually... Uh, was nominated to finalist in iHorror Awards to screenplay this last uh, week. And then I'm shooting Night Watchers with Brian Farmer as well in March and uh, a couple of things this summer. So keep myself busy. And uh, again, very happy to be in Colorado and, and contribute to the, to the art history and creation of this uh, beautiful state. Yeah, so then this summer, I'm actually involved in a very interesting project. It's uh, in regards, it, it's, uh, it's about an, an, an American army base left on Iceland. Uh, that they left like 20 years ago and, and now they, the scientists are coming back there and it's, it's, it's a sci-fi movie. 
So you know they find they, 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 the the army base really exists, and they did leave it alone. They did leave it behind on Iceland. It's called Keflavik, uh, but then obviously they involved some fiction in it as well, and and uh, you know little science fiction spin to the whole thing. Then what they are going to discover in that old army base, you uh, you know time will tell, and when you see the movie, you know what I'm talking about. Film is collaborative. Getting out and helping artists make their movies is a fun day for me. I always meet the most interesting people and learn something new. These filmmakers have a lot more experience than me. 